Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading My In-Laws Are Obsessed With Me, episode 75. This is a season finale. So uh, I'm gonna do a little thing, I'm gonna do some stuff a little bit different on for my people who are on the Patreon page. For all the pledgers, I will start to combine all the videos for my in-laws for my read for the week all in one. So if I upload like three videos for that week, it will all combine into one. So you guys don't have to go to separate like videos and links to watch one read. Uh, for YouTube, it's going to be the same uh, as it had always been. So uh, if I release one episode every other day or every, you know, once every three days, it's going to be like that from now on. But uh, on Patreon, it's going to be one one big video of like two to three episode or five it depends on the week all right guys let's go ahead and get started <gasps> very shoddy <clears throat> oh um <clears throat> your graces thank you for gracing us with your presence it is truly an honor a pet your grace it's so good to see you I'm so happy. Time sure is flying today. Were things also the he this hectic for your weddings? Uh, but of course, mine is too small to even compare to yours, but... Uh, what are you talking about? Right. The size of the, the wedding doesn't matter. I could tell you put a lot of care into even the smallest of details. Uh, it's a wonderful wedding. My in-laws are obsessed with me. Episode 75. They're holding hands. Please drink the cocktails I've prepared. Uh, you'll find them on the table on the right. I'm positive they'll be to your liking. How is it? Mm. Mm. By the way, it would seem the Grand Duke is still very popular. Your graces, uh, you honor us. We didn't know we'd see you here. <sighs> of course I'd come. It's my wife's friend's wedding. His wife's friend? <gasps> oh. I see. I can't believe he's just answered so kindly. Somehow the air about him has changed since that day. That night, the night you went to see Theo. Pardon? The night he was staying in the annex because he had a seizure. He woke up as soon as you went to him. I wouldn't say he woke up that quickly. Do you think that's a coincidence as well? Do you think that's a coincidence as well? Um... Is he insinuating that it's fate? I believe it's time to do doubt everything right now. It may be that those who came back to life could serve as a new variable for our seizures. So please do stay by his side if you can. Please, enough. He did say that, but seeing how he comes in contact with me more often, he must care more about the curse. But it's understandable. It's getting rather hot. Perhaps we could let each other go for now? Oh, he's grown a lot kinder. Hmm? Then there's this too. I told him it'll be nice to have something to prove our marriage, and he gave me he gave this to me right away. But it wouldn't mean anything if I'm the only one wearing a ring, would it? <laughs> I was like all teary eyed. Uh, <laughs> Is it my friend Stunning? The wedding hall is so beautiful, too. 
Do you like this sort of thing? I do. It's so beautiful. <laughs> I'm grateful. Grateful that I could come here today. <laughs> Her husband's manor is in the northwest. It snows a lot there. My friend said she can't wait to see it. Come to think of it, the Grand Dukedom is also in the north, right? You must have seen snow quite often. It doesn't snow a lot here in the capital, so we used to love it when it snowed. I can imagine. Hmm? She's going to throw her bouquet now. Let's go watch. Only one of my friends isn't married yet, so she's supposed to catch it. Huh? Huh? Uh. Huh? Oh, he got it. Oh. Huh? Huh? His, his grace has caught the bouquet. Oh, congratulations for your current married life. <laughs> Since you already met a good person, your life will be full of joy. Oh, may happiness be with you. Oh, she blushed. Oh, she walking away. Oh, my goodness. Perry. <laughs> Did you see their faces? I didn't think you'll catch the bouquet like that. Oh, the looks on their faces. <laughs> it's so cute. What is this? I thought you're the one who asked for an accessory to show others. I was just thinking of a pendant or something like that. But isn't this a family heirloom? I see your scars are almost gone. Um, huh? Don't tell me he... If it's all right with you, would you like to come to the Grand Dukedom with me one day? Huh? Mm. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. So like, okay. I read Operation True Love and it's a, pretty much about high school couples or a high school girl trying to find love and trying to increase her love meter and all that stuff and right now where i'm at is that where she fell in love with one of the guys and the guys love her back and they're like oh i see forever with you and i'm just like oh you know and i'm just like oh, whatever okay you know but here i don't know why but i feel like oh this is wonderful it's cute it makes more sense you know like I um, I don't know. I can't explain it, but I root for this type of romance versus like the kiddish like we're in high school and we love each other and we're gonna be together forever, you know? Like shut up. Like it's <sighs> no, you know? Grow up, live your life first, see the world, and then find your person. Or if that person's with you through your development and growth, yes, sure, yeah, that is your forever, but you're too young to know what forever is when you're in high school. Like, that's just me, you know? Like, anyways, I'm blabbering and, you know, venting. All right, guys, on to the next one. Bye!